Obviously, you're uh, Jewish. Yeah. Um, it's Hanukkah. Happy Hanukkah. Happy Hanukkah. Um, best Hanukkah gift you ever received? Oof. I think it would. I think it would have to be the, like an, an Xbox. Just like when you get like a big video game console. I don't think anything beats that. And I think just the Xbox one year. The Xbox was such a step up. You know what I mean? So I think it was the Xbox. Worst Hanukkah gift ever. Oh. I mean, simply just the gel, which is like the chocolate candy. Like I've gotten just bags of, it's little coin-shaped milk chocolate. That's good as like a nice little side gift, but not as like the main gift. And I've gotten it as like a main gift. It's pretty weak. Now, if people don't really know like the Jewish culture, yeah, Hanukkah is a holiday on eight nights. Yep. And some people follow the tradition of gift giving on eight nights. Yep. Did you ever experience eight nights worth of gifts? And yeah. For, and how many years of that in your childhood growing up? Did it? St what year did it stop? And it might have just been a couple nights or just one night. Or I think that it varied. I think there are certain times where it was a couple nights and certain times where it was eight nights. If it was ever eight nights, it was like small gift, small gift, small gift, small gift, big gift, small gift, small gift, like two big gifts. You know what I mean? Like I might have gotten the guilt on one of the nights. You know what I mean? It was like little things. It was never like eight legitimate presents. Um, and I think it stopped probably around like age 15 or so, if I'm being honest. Just the celebration in general. I think we'd light the candles and then it'd be like, cool, all the presents up front. We don't really need to get together eight straight days like that. 